Bryson, you are not the brother. Loves, it's naturally be Nikki and welcome back to my channel now that you're here be sure to like comment share subscribe for all the latest tea I drop and if you really want to get into it be sure to visit my website naturallybnikki.com I do appreciate you oh wow Bryson and Simone are a thing now me when Simone said babe 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 Let's not forget last week when Simone ended up leaving Bryson in the crib talking about, yeah, that's my friend. <laughs> you trying to go out to eat though? Yeah. So we went from Bryson who to Bryson's my boo? Is that what we doing? Boomerang, y'all petty for that. We then find out that there is a possibility Bryson and Simone may be siblings. Oh my God. <laughs> My chest. <laughs> y'all, for real, for real, for real. Come on, y'all. All just for that. Because y'all really even imagine licking and lapping with somebody you even think is your brother or sister. Let, let's just take a second. And here goes Simone talking about, try not to worry about it, babe. Try not to worry about it. Are you for real? That's all I'm worried about, Simone. What's wrong with you? You can be my whole sister. That's nasty. And then after Boomerang drops that bomb on us, we then find out that Ari is directing Tia's music video. Okay? But things aren't going so well. Okay? Ari could use some work. But I will say I really, really enjoyed that conversation between Ari and Simone. And Simone was literally like calling him out for, you know, needing some work. He, he's talented, but he's not polished. And how he needs to kind of sharpen his skills a bit. That is what friendship is all about. Come on, okay? Giving you that constructive feedback, criticism, you know, while still loving on you, supporting you, and trusting your talents and your visions. That's exactly how Simone approached it. And that my friends, is what true friendship looks and feels like, okay? I tweeted that when I watched it, and I'm saying it again. They ended that conversation with Ari saying, you know, I'm going to do better. I'm going to go harder. You know, that's what your friends are supposed to do. If they're not motivating you and pushing you to go harder, what you really got? Then the whole gang pulls up on the Atlanta Black Pride Fest. And y'all, this is where it really goes down. I love those in-your-face shots of all those beautiful, bold, unapologetically uh, black, beautiful people, okay? I loved it. Just all up in your face, making straight up eye contact like you're going to get this pride today. It was so intentional and it was so needed. That representation, that straight up in your face representation, so beautiful. Seeing David in that setting and just being so supportive, being so positive and being such an ally, like it was so refreshing. You know, he's passing out flyers, encouraging, you know, everyone to come to church. He's like, everybody's welcome. And when David said, being queer isn't a choice, it's a gift from God. <sighs> I lost it. Everything. Absolutely everything. Can David and Crystal just get back together? Can they? Can I just say I love Rocky? Okay, she is so blunt <laughs> and so supportive. Like, oh my God, she be going so hard for Tia. Anywhere you see Tia, you see Rocky, okay? Tia, I'm just saying though, I'm just saying though, here go Rocky. I'm saying, uh, I'm saying, uh, black love at its finest, okay? I also really loved Ari um, and his character development in this episode, like where he really talked about, you know, not having formal training and how he kind of just had to pick the lock. You know what I'm saying? He didn't really have access to a lot, so he had to get it how he lived. And that's a very real story, you know, for a lot of creatives and just a lot of black folks in general. I love who he represents and who he lends a voice to. Ari's Kind of, you know, back and forth with that shorty, one of his old shorties. That was a very educational moment for me. Um, you know, just learning the, the challenges and the obstacles that, you know, the bisexual community faces. How they're often made to feel like a minority within a minority. 
is crazy. The thing that really got me about her is she's at the Atlanta Pride event, supposed to be supporting her brother who's gay, but you can't be supportive of Ari who's bisexual. If you was going to be all like that, you should have stayed your funky $12 jewelry, blue glittery Claire's jacket, but home. That's what you should have did. But Ari had time and he got you together. Okay, I love when he said he not gonna allow nobody to put him in a box so they can feel comfortable. I really appreciated Ari saying that, man. I really appreciated him saying that. And like I said, I ain't even got a drag shorty for real because he did it for, for all of us. <laughs> Just know, we got your back, Ari. Know that. Let's not act like he ain't saved that sinking ship of a music video, okay, White Chocolate was trying to produce. Well, nobody feeling it. Ari might have some work to do, okay? And he may need a little polish, but he definitely got vision. And I'm here for him having that big old director's title and little white chocolate in the little byline. I was real here for that, okay? <laughs> if you watch the movie, you know where I'm going. The washing the dishes scene. Then they plopped on that couch and started watching the movie. And guess who gonna pop up on the screen? Miss Eartha Kitt, honey. Come on! Come on, homage. Come on, subtle boomerang references. And that was mad cute, but there was still quite questions that needed answers, okay? Are Bryson and Simone brother and sister or no? <laughs> okay, it's time, it's time. Then here's, here goes Simone. Check the app, babe, check the app. Y'all, I ain't never been so scared for them two in my life. I said, oh my God. The next thing I know, they getting it popping. Didn't even wait. Bryson didn't even put the phone down yet before they got it popping. But y'all, I ain't even mad at them, okay? Cause ain't nothing better than post, you ain't my sibling, you know what? <laughs> Boomerang just keeps getting better and better. It's it's crazy. Expect these reviews Wednesday nights. All right, your girl got a nine to five, so I still got to get up on time. But best believe Wednesday nights, these reviews is coming your way. And also follow me on Twitter, y'all, because I be live tweeting the show now. Okay, follow me at Naturally Be Nikki, the same as my YouTube channel. Y'all, it's literally just too much tea in these streets. All right, that's all I got, but I am curious to hear from y'all. What are your thoughts on Simone and Bryson being a thing now? Okay, let me know in the comments below. Let's keep the conversation going, and I'll see y'all next video.